welcome back to my channel you guys it has been a long time i have been wanting to pick back up youtube but i just haven't really figured out like what do i want to share what am i going to say let's go ahead and restart shall we i thought why not just like show you a little bit of like my morning routine get ready yeah take you kind of through my day maybe do a house tour should we do a house tour today i think we should do a house tour i've never done one but i think we should do a house tour today all right, let's go. I need my coffee. It is an Americano with an espresso shot and some Cool Whip. Here's my outfit. I'm still getting ready this morning. We just dropped, got the kids off to school. I'm wearing like an oversized tee. These are in my Sunday's pajama pants and I'm about to take my curlers out with you guys. Okay, so when I got hair extensions, I was like, I need to figure out like ways to keep my hair, my face while I'm sleeping because it just feels so weird. I've never had hair this long before. I started doing the heatless curls. I was like, you know what? This is been like the best thing for my hair especially with extensions and it just it's like done for the most part I usually go in with like a curling iron I'm getting ready but look how pretty I love her so good to like also just kind of like scratch my head look how pretty this is from Amazon it comes with everything that you need like scrunchies like a clip all of it and it's super soft so it's comfy to sleep on like the other ones are like almost too hard, you know, but this one is so soft and squishy and like easy. And what I like is that you can like tie this and do a cute little bow. How fun this is. And it's only $15. Not bad. Like $15.99. Okay, so I've been doing these workouts that are called the Sculpt Society. I found them on TikTok and then I just did like a deep dive on their Instagram and also like read reviews and all the things. And I love it because it's like low impact, but like you definitely get a sweat on. Like I'm constantly sweating in the class. I thought that I would show you guys. Workout, I need deodorant, but my deodorant is in my vanity. So let's go get that and then let's, let's work out together. Hey honey. Hey. I'm getting ready to work out. Jackson is gonna be upstairs with me. And yes, I definitely utilize iPad time for this because mama's gotta do what she's gotta do, you know? Oh my gosh, this is such a good setup for a get ready with me. This deodorant, I have not smelled stinky armpits in forever. So this deodorant, I was using the Rio Dio from Sol de Janeiro for a long time, but I just felt like, I don't know, it didn't last. I still love the smell of that one over this one. This one smells also equally as good. I think I just like the the notes of that deodorant more. I have to put something on my lips. And I usually wash my face after I work out just because I'm gonna get in the shower anyways, so I might as well shower, then do my skincare. Today, I have my brand new assistant starting work with me, so you guys will get to meet her. She helps me just in my day to day. There's a lot that like goes on behind the scenes of creating TikToks, reels, all of it. So this channel will be like a lot more behind the scenes of my day to day life, a little bit more like longer. Like on TikTok, I only show like up to two minutes of my morning or two minutes of our nighttime routine there's so much more that happens behind the scenes so on this channel you guys are gonna get like a lot of like in between of Cecily's life like the in between and like so just a lot of faith too when I first started this page it was like mostly faith based and like me talking straight to the camera and not a lot of lifestyle I am a lifestyle creator like that is how I started that's how I want to always create so I'm gonna keep up with that trend here I doing this channel i will put mine up on the mirror and i'll show you guys hold it up using the octabuddy and this is just like an app lower pace class be right back i need to go get my water and my coffee buddy follows me everywhere buddy buddy hi chatting with my sister-in-law Samantha you wanna say hi? hi. <laughs> yeah <laughs> and she's working out too she says hello world <laughs> when we're on the phone we catch up about life we talk about work we talk about kids we talk about our husbands we talk about what, what else do we talk about everything everything literally everything like anything that yeah. is currently in our brain we vocalize to each other yes so like my thought never like my thoughts really aren't inside my brain because they're being they're coming out of my mouth to Samantha 
Sure. Okay. Um, it's all kind of like button down, short sleeve. Easter's, oh, wow. Easter's gonna be warm. I put cold up in my coffee every morning. Well, that was hot, but it's also very good. Nummy. This is my good American shipment though. I'm excited. I can't, oh, I got a bathing suit. Oh yeah, baby, this is cute. Samantha, you would love their stuff. I got this like black corset top. It's like super cropped, so I will have to wear high rise jeans with it, but I love her. Cutie cutie. Okay, bathing suit time. Oh yes, oh my gosh, yay! It's like a purple cheetah print. Oh cute. Love. I had a bathing suit like this when I was like a toddler. Oh, they sent me two tops. Wait, I didn't order the bottoms. <laughs> Stop. No. Ah. Well, okay, moving on, I gotta get ready. My closet just is always in a state of kind of like chaos, but then I pick it up again, so we're good. I'm gonna wear this top today. It's from Target. I just really like how simple it is. Simple it is, can you top? I'm gonna wear my favorite denim ever in the world. These are the Abercrombie Curve Love 90s Relaxed Jean High Rise. They're my fave. And then I don't know how I'm gonna accessorize it yet, but I'll get there when I'm like getting ready. I need to go get in the shower, so I'll be right back. I need to do my skincare. Shoot, let's come over to my bathroom. Bear with me as I'm getting used to this whole thing and just giving it my all. I've been using Skin Farm products ever since we moved out here, like kind of like in May. It's such a difference like overall in my skin. Guys, I can't believe I'm gonna be 36 this year. What? What? I still feel like I just had Capri and James. So it also equally feels like forever ago. These are the crystal clear clarifying pads. They have salicylic acid in it to like help with acne treatment. I do break out, but it's usually hormonal. I'm out of a lot of products from them too. So I need to go in, in, their, in their spa and get some more. This is a hyaluronic acid and peptide treatment. And this just helps with like pumping your skin, fine lines. I'm just making your skin look so dewy. I just recently added this into my routine and I give things like a couple weeks before I talk about it. But this is the Glow Recipe Watermelon Niacinamide Dew Drops. A mom at Cheer, like Heather, your skin looks so good. Like what are you using? She was like, it's the Glow Recipe Watermelon Drops. And I was like, add to cart immediately. Usually products will make me break out within the first couple weeks of using it. And when it does that, I have to rotate it out of my routine, sadly. But this hasn't, so we're good. This is a new brow. It's a brow enhancing serum. My new assistant is going to get here in the next like 15 minutes. And I'm excited for you guys to meet her. Sam is getting Jackson dressed right now. Who's dressed? Oh. He's dressed. Daddy, you're on it. I love you. I'm gonna, this is the Day Fairy Duster Dry Shampoo. I'm gonna take this over to my counter, like my makeup counter. This is a brightening lotion. I use this during the day. It's a mineral tinted SPF, and it just adds a little bit of like tinted moisturizer to your skin. See like, it's just a small amount. But I do wear foundation on top of it. If I was running errands and like, like if I was going out to like work out outside the house, this is all that I would put on. We're looking dewy. Let's go do hair and makeup. This is my current makeup setup. Oh boy. Look at the drawer, you guys. Ooh, it's kind of looking crazy. It's crazy. It's crazy. I bought these to organize, so I'm gonna make a TikTok of them today, and I'm gonna clean out this too. Love you. Bye, baby. I'm going in with the Fairy Duster dry shampoo. I am obsessed with this product. Like, love, love, love. I normally don't really like dry shampoo, in my opinion. I just feel like it can make my hair feel super stiff because my hair is like super coarse naturally. What that means is like, it just feels a little bit like more rough on like the texture. Like it, my hair doesn't feel super soft naturally. So dry shampoos tend to like just make it feel even more dried out, which I don't love. But this does not make my hair feel that way. It makes it feel like I just washed it. So it'll probably give me another like couple days without having to wash my hair because with extensions, <laughs> It takes forever to get my hair like back in normal. Okay, so one, let's be real. I'm gonna be real about my extensions here for a second. The one thing that like is like my biggest, I don't know, pet peeve with my extensions is how my hair is like significantly shorter right here than the rest of the extensions. I need, my hairstylist was like just like, you, what you have to do is kind of like straighten it to blend it. 
out. I just got a new hair straightener too. This is the T3, T3 Micro, and I got it on Amazon. I use their curling iron and I love it. All right, also like top parts of my hair, I like to kind of straighten out a little bit. Just kind of give it like a more polished look. It looks a little slept on and worked out in. Like this little, oh, I think Haven is here. Be right back! This is Hi. Haven! <laughs> Isn't she gorgeous? She's so sweet. <laughs> Seriously. And she brought me coffee. Oh yeah, we had to start the day off right. <laughs> So we're, I'm gonna finish getting ready and then we're gonna be doing like to show her how to We're gonna talk about editing. We're gonna go grocery shopping today. Yay. We're gonna do all the I'm fun so things excited. I'm so excited yeah. <laughs> Jackson decided to get ready with me and so did Dolly. <laughs> and then I have Haven like sitting over with laundry. <laughs> We're definitely getting like more of like a behind the scene on my YouTube yeah. channel. Okay, right now Haven and I are cleaning out my makeup drawer. We are filming it on yes. for TikTok. This is like our little setup. But currently I have makeup drawer number one done. And then I have this one to do next. We got this all like together. Now we're gonna film it for TikTok and like put it all together. It's gonna look really cool. So I'm excited. Haven's helping me like be able to see it all and make sure that we're in frame. Totally. She's the best. <laughs> I have not done like a house tour since we moved in and I feel like now is the time. It is definitely gonna be like something more relaxed and chill. The kids got home early from school because it was early dismissal. I have to leave here for cheer in about 45 minutes. So I wanna do this really quick and add this part of my vlog before we get into the house tour. Please let me know in the comments what you guys like want to see. Just more content like on YouTube. I feel like I can do longer videos and I love that. So let me know what you guys want to know about, see all the things. So let's go, let's do the house tour. I'm gonna pass the camera off to Haven and she's Perfect. gonna like walk with me. So first, this is our entryway. Um, I love like little details that we have in our house. This is a picture of me and Sam back in like 2019, like pre-Jackson. Um, and this is at a beach in La Jolla. Over here is our dining room. It's kind of messy, kind of like the throw whatever you want on the table kind of room. Like, don't know what I'm doing over there, but definitely a work in progress, like everything in my life. This is honestly a bathroom that like sold me on the house just because it's so like captivating. I don't know. Like I love the green, the tile in the shower and like on like the, like just wrapped around is so pretty. The bath mats are not pretty, but that's okay. <laughs> this is our guest bath. This is the bathroom that are like is the most accessible to people when they come over. This is Sam's office. He has Zoom meetings right now, but do you guys like his like charger? Gear. And then he's got a TV right here. His fantasy football trophy. His fantasy football trophy. Next up is our kitchen, where we literally spend most of our time is like kitchen and living room. It's kind of a mess right now because everybody just got home, we're kind of thrown some things on the counter. Look, Sam just brought me flowers. He's the best. I have to put that on water. Funny story, I remember this hood. We like, before we decided that we were gonna move out to Tennessee, I don't know, six months before, we started like praying about like, are we gonna move? Are we not gonna move? Because Sam's side of the family all decided to move out here. And I remember having a dream in our kitchen. Inside the kitchen, we had like all these people over and like they were gathering in our kitchen and it felt like a Bible study. But then I remember the hood above our stove had a wood hood to it. And I was like, this is so crazy. Like, why is there a wood hood? And when we decided to move, I was like, what if we like found a house with a wood hood? And you guys, this was like, when we moved here, we started looking at houses immediately, like the week, the week that we moved here. And then we saw this house, it had a wood hood. Crazy, and then we got our offer accepted and the rest is history. It's just wild. Like God is always speaking, no matter what, like he is always speaking to you. This is our living room. This is where we spend like, 
a lot of our time. Like last night, we one of our favorite things to do as a family is just like turn on a movie and watch something together, pop popcorn after dinner. But that's usually like on nights that we don't have practices or like on the weekend. Gosh, I did not clean up for you guys. I'm so sorry. <laughs> but I figured this is just for life. Hi, Mama. My mom's here doing her makeup. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. Okay, so this is our bedroom, which you guys have definitely seen before. Bedroom over here. Not all the tripods, just <laughs> randomly laying around my house. I don't even know why. Like, I have so many tripods. I'm joking. I know why. The next is like our closet. So people, like, when they've seen my closet clean out or like cleaning my closet, they're like, where does Sam put all of his clothes? It's mm -hmm. basically like a copy paste on either side. So, like, there's hers and his. Here's her side of the closet mine which is a definite like disaster right now Sam's is also kind of a disaster too like we're definitely not organized people um but yeah then our bathroom it's kind of also a mess um i still have not fixed my mirror you guys this needs to happen it's so bad haven's like what the heck are you afraid it's gonna fall on you uh, i would be i'm not afraid anymore because it hasn't happened yet my house is like all a work in progress i feel like there's been parts of our house that just is not like designed and organized the way that i would love to see it but it's okay we will one day get there this is where i will work out so like this morning when you guys saw me working out with my phone like earlier in the video when you guys saw me working out this is where i was i like working out inside but we do have a treadmill in our garage and like some other equipment i just personally like more of like the lower key type workouts here this is like intentionally was supposed to be for like the kids like game room look closely because there's definitely like food and water stains on the couch <laughs> or juice stains or soda stains or something but this is like where the kids play video games all that here's the boys room and the next beautiful bathroom <laughs> we love i mean i love that they have a bathroom upstairs it's just kind of messy we have the girls rooms capri's room and then over here is gracie's room and that's basically the upstairs and our entire house. That was fun. <laughs> if you guys like this tour, let me know in the comments. Also, please like and subscribe. I read all of the comments. I just love getting to know like what you guys like watching as well as like just what you like from this video. And if you don't follow me on Instagram or TikTok, please do so. I post videos all the time, stories like in real time. So head over there and do that. All right, thanks for watching guys. Love you, bye.